Hey guys, it's Colnar here, and I'm making another video. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get iCleaner Pro for iOS. Uh, and this only works for jailbroken devices. And yeah, iOS, iCleaner sorry, Pro deletes uh, unnecessary files that aren't being used and clears up a lot of space. And yeah, so let's start. So the first thing you want to do is go to Cydia. And... Uh, go to sources and if you don't have uh, this source right here hack your iPhone there uh, you will want to go edit add and write repo dot hack your iPhone dot org and you will want to press add source and I'm not sure but it probably won't respring but it can but it I don't, I'm not sure. And you want to add source and respring if necessary. Okay, so I have it so I don't have to do that. And next you want to go to search. And search for iCleaner Pro. iCleaner, then space, pro, pro. And there will be a bunch of them. Forget about the, the beta and cracked one. And you want to find this one. And it's it's 7.5.6k, that's the version. And it's as you can see, it, there will be like a hitch and then... Uh, Facebook like and two Twitter logos and this is how it will look if you want to see because there will be a couple of similar ones but you want to get this one and there this is just says about the application and you want to press install and yeah you press on the top right corner but I already installed it and it says modify but it will press install okay and yeah and I'm gonna show you how it looks like right now and this is what, what it looks like there and if, if you go here this is what it will come up as you will you, you want to go to excluded apps the very last uh, option and these are all the apps and you you can select the apps you want uh, the this application to go through like I want to go through all my games to search through them and delete all unnecessary folders and stuff like that but I don't re I make sure you be careful when you select Cydia because sometimes it can do uh, Cydia uh, sometimes this can delete uh, useful stuff of Cydia, Cydia so don't take Cydia but you can take other stuff so yeah and then you can press back and t the top right corner press clean and I already clean it like cleaned it uh, like an hour ago so it won't be much but sometimes it can go up to like one gigabyte or something so there 124 megabytes so yeah and you then you have to respring it and yeah i hope this helped thanks for watching